Hey everybody, uh, welcome, welcome in, welcome into Periscope, and uh, tonight is day 17 of the Triple S Veda Challenge, which is vlogging every day in August, and uh, tonight's topic is uh, 80s, favorite 80s movies, and so uh, those of you that are joining in here, I'm going to be asking you, I'm going to be sharing some of mine. Now, probably what prompted this is I'm kind of off schedule with what the actual calendar is, but it was, you know, as far as uh, topics go, but I just got through watching The Wedding Singer, and that made me think about uh, all the 80 movie, 80s movies that I really, really love and really enjoy. So I'm going to start with uh, you guys telling me uh, what are, let's go by topic, okay? So let's start with comedies, okay? What are your favorite 80s comedies? Do you have some favorite 80s comedies that you enjoy? Um, you know, some for me were anything by, um, uh, were anything like Blazing Saddles was a great comedy movie for me. Uh, of course, a lot of these movies I saw when I was in junior high, so a lot of it was junior high uh, humor. <laughs> Christmas Vacation, that's a good one. Uh, absolutely. Um, oh, okay. Uh, let's see. Uh, you know, any, anything, anything, uh, Spaceballs uh, was hilarious. Once again, it's very, very junior high. I think I got most of them. I mean, I, mean, I think I'm really, uh, this is really strange. I think I'm really blessed to have grown up in the 80s. I think, I don't know, as you get older, uh, do you think the 80s were, uh, st are still what I would call the, the, I don't know, I guess what you grow up, I, like the golden age of movies. I know that now we have great technology, we have great uh, whatever, but I think everything that we see today is predicated on really good movie making and really good stuff that happened in the 80s uh, that people reach back to, right? I think probably in the 80s because they reached back in the 60s maybe for some of that. What are some of your other favorite comedy movies? I'll tell you something obscure, like obscure comedy movies uh, that were really that your teeny kind of whatever, like um, Fast Times at Ridgemont High. That was a uh, that was funny with Jeff Spicoli. Um, I liked... Um, uh, what else? Let's see. Strange stuff. There was a movie called The In-Laws uh, with Alan Arkin and oh, I can't remember what was in that. Alan Arkin and God, I can't remember who it is. But anyway, that was a hilarious movie. That's kind of a, uh, you know, weird off topic movie. Uh, but what are some of the other what are some of your comedy movies that you like from the 80s? What are some great 80s? Pretty in Pink was good. That was a good comedy. Um it's a bunch of other ones. What are some other ones you guys like? What are some ones that you enjoy in the Periscope universe here? By the way, and if you're watching this on my YouTube channel, please feel free to leave me your favorite 80s comedy right now. That's what we're talking about is comedies, okay? Um, what are some other what are some other great comedies that you know that By the way, talking you know as you're adding here by the way, I want to say that uh, you know, they tried to, you mentioned, somebody here mentioned uh, Christmas Vacation, and I'm like, are you kidding me, man? I mean, these remakes of, these reboots and remakes of 80s, and they're totally getting it wrong. They're totally screwing those things up. And so, another reason why we should just stay with the original stuff. Quit trying to remake things, and let's at least be try to be original there, okay? All right, so let's move from comedies into action movies. What are some of your favorite action movies? course i'm a big indiana jones fan love that um indiana jones anything rocky was good uh top gun absolutely um uh i'm gonna say anything first blood was good uh the terminator terminator was excellent um let's see good 80s action movies what are some of your favorite ones guys what are some ones that you enjoy um, uh, just tell me some, some ones that you like there. If I mention one that you like, of course, thank you for the hearts there, by the way. Um, let's see some other good eighties action movies. Anything, you know what? Eighties was a good time for Chuck Norris. Those were good Chuck Norris movies. I know they were cheesy, but I mean, you know, they were just good movies. I mean, you know, uh, <laughs> they were just, they were just so terrible. And, you know, he wasn't a great actor, but, you know, Invasion USA, that was kind of a cool, classic Chuck Norris movie. Um, I'm trying to think, uh, let's see, Missing in Action, uh, was good. Um, 
man, tons of good ones like that. What are some of your favorite action ones? What are some of your favorite action movies from the 80s? You guys tell me. Action movies. Anybody? Anybody have some favorite ones? Feel free to share. Hey, welcome in, Jordan. Tell me some of your favorite 80s. We're, we, we've talked about comedies already. Let's talk about action movies. Any of, Anybody else, your favorite uh, action movies? Of course, it was a good time for, uh, you know, Jackie Chan movies. It was a good time. Those were excellent. Um, Jackie Chan movies were killer. Grew up on that stuff, and that was pretty awesome. Um, anybody else? Anybody else? Action movies? Come on, guys. I know you got some. Beverly Hills Cop. Thank you so much. Absolutely. That was a good action movie and a good comedy, by the way. Um, uh, Beverly Hills 2, not so much. It was still pretty good, though, because it still had original cast. And then when it got to 3, it got kind of terrible. But uh, uh, I definitely enjoyed Beverly Hills Cop. Anything Eddie Murphy was pretty good in the 80s, I have to say. Anything Eddie Murphy had had hit his sweet spot, I think, there in the 80s. And, and I thought that was uh, that was pretty good. Um, oh, Stir Crazy. Let me go back to comedies real quick. Stir Crazy. Um, was an excellent one with Richard Pryor, Gene Wilder. That was good. Um, other comedies like, um, oh gosh, uh, golly, I'm trying to think now. Another Gene Wilder movie, uh, with Frankenstein in it. Oh, Indiana Jones, absolutely. Indiana Jones, definitely a good series. Any other action movies? James Bond movies were really good, uh, back then for the most part. Um, you know, I was kind of, a, I I didn't mind, uh, you know, Roger Moore was kind of hot then uh, for the James Bond movies, but those were pretty good. Uh, Connery had made at least one more, I think, in the 80s. That was pretty good. All right, so let's move on. We talked about action movies. Uh, we talked about uh, comedies. Uh, what about romantic movies? Romantic comedies, maybe? Anybody? Anybody have any of the of romantic things that you thought were uh, kind of, uh, uh, you know, made you, um, you know, grab the tissue box or anything like that. Come on, you guys know some. I'm sure you do. Some that you remember here. If you're in here, you love 80s movies, so. that you think we're good? Uh, me, I, I gotta tell you, I don't watch a ton of them, but there were some, um, uh, there were some really good, uh, there really were some good, some good movies. Uh, and I'm trying to remember some of the romantic comedy ones that I thought were, when Harry Met Sally, I think that was an 80s one. That was pretty good. I enjoyed that. Um, what else? Anybody else? Anybody have a good romantic comedy one? Anything at all? No? Okay. All right. Well, guys, I enjoyed uh, talking movies with you guys tonight. That's uh, part of a Triple S Beta Challenge. Um, what do you guys think? If you're in my, if you're, if you're, do you think movies are better today or worse? Do you think the 80s, uh, you know, of course we were biased here because if you grew up in the 80s, um, you enjoyed them. But do you think movies are better today? Are movies better made? Or are there better quality? Are they, you know, what do you guys think about that? Just tell me your opinion. By the way, if you're watching this on my YouTube channel, just go ahead and leave a comment down below and tell me whether or not you think 80s movies are better or worse uh, then today, are we getting the best of today? Or are we, um, are we just kind of whatever you think it's about even or every generation kind of has its thing. So Periscope peeps, what do you think? Do you think 80 movies are, are better or worse? Are they, are, or do we just remember them more fondly? Maybe, I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to stick with it. 80s movies. Definitely like them. Um, anyway, so that's it, Triple S Beta Challenge today, vlogging every day in August, part of the Beta Challenge put up by uh, Amy uh, Schmittauer. And so uh, I'm going to wrap up my time with you guys today, trying to stay consistent and um, uh, in doing this every day, even if it's late like this. So hope you enjoy the time here together. By the way, if you are a um, brand new viewer to my YouTube channel, please hit the subscribe button right here. They'll get videos like this in your inbox. And, of course, if you are um, just a regular viewer, that you always view and you always catch these uh, videos. Thank you so much for watching. Thanks for being a part of this community. I hope that you'll leave some comments down below. Keep the conversation going. I hope these videos have been beneficial for you getting to know me a little bit better. 
uh, beyond just the screen and beyond just my roles and responsibilities as a youth pastor and other things, and that I have other interests and ideas and thoughts and things like that. So anyway, thanks for joining me tonight, uh, you Periscope guys. Appreciate you being a part. Appreciate you being a part of the conversation here. And if you have uh, anything else, you just hit me up, and uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow uh, on the Triple S Beta Challenge. And after the beta thing goes on, I'm going to continue to do, do Periscope, by the way, and I'm uh, going to continue to do some content stuff and things like that. So feel free to uh, hit me up on Twitter if you have suggestions, ideas, stuff like that. So anyway, guys, thanks for joining me for a little while, and uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow, okay? Have a good day, everybody.